our screens. We got Amanda behind the camera. Hey guys, Amanda here. So we are out in Big Pine Key and we are trying to catch a Wahoo. Right? Absolutely. So basically, we're down here during the coronavirus and we have a personal goal of trying to catch a Wahoo while everything is just shut down. So that's what we're doing today. Wish us luck, guys. Hopefully we catch one. We got our planers out and we're in the right water depth. We're in like 150 to 200. We're waiting for Mr. Wahoo to bite. for what like 20 seconds yeah like 20 seconds look at that rod staying deep yeah he so, is staying deep. kind of acting like a tuna acting tuna like maybe blackfin tuna all right hold on guys him though right yeah send him back we're gonna send him back here he goes he lives to see another day not the targeted species not the targeted species but skunk off the boat let's get going all right mr bonita mr monster bonita you tricked us you tricked us come on how was that emily uh, i mean you know, it wasn't, it wasn't Mr. Wahoo, it wasn't Black Ventura, it was Mr. Bonita. But, <laughs> thankfully, we needed Mr. Bonita because Mr. Bonita is what we're using for bait. But you know what's so funny? Mr. Bonita ate Mr. Bonita. Mr. Bonita ate Mr. Bonita. So we had a Bonita. Oh, wow, he is going crazy. Anyways, Mr. Bonita, thank you because we need you because if for some reason Mr. Wahoo decides not to bite today, I'm gonna need you for bait for tomorrow. Fish on! Fish on! Fish on! What do you think it is? I know! All right, Amanda. Yeah. It's twin truth time. Twin truth time. All right, what's a twin truth? Hold on, hold on. I gotta, sorry guys. Gotta keep Amanda set, set straight. All right. Okay, twin truth. Um, let's see. Do you have any ideas? Um, how about a story. what? How about a story? A story. You guys we want? We're in third grade. Wow. All right. We've called each other sissy our entire lives. We still do. We still do. She's sissy. I'm sissy. And we were in third grade. We were like people made fun of us that like, um we called each other sissy. Like why do you call her sissy? sissy? So then we were like, all right. I gotta call you by your first name. So we tried it in third grade, and we didn't like it. So, <laughs> hold on, I gotta get the planer off. Mid story. Mid story. After. Hold on. Look at the look at us when you talk. All right. Keep fighting your fishy. I'm telling After the story. About a day in third grade of calling each other by our first names, we decided we didn't like it. We wanted to call each other sissy again. So we were like, sissy, sissy, sissy. we're sissies. Yeah. And now, to this day, we still call each other sissy, except on charters, because we realized it was really weird to yell at each other from like the transom to the bow, sissy! <laughs> now, we, now, now when we work, we call each other family and Amanda. But, <laughs> in the day to day, she's sissy, and I'm sissy. There's your twin tree. That was a great story. <laughs> I liked it. All right. What is it? 
Um, flash. I saw a flash. I'm thinking it's another bomber. Uh, no. Yep. Yep. It's a big bonito. <laughs> Don't get him in the motor. <laughs> oh, it's Skippy. It's a Skippy. All right. Do we want to get? Want to gaff it? You got it. Amanda's got it. Oh, it's a bomber. Oh. Bomber bonito. We got bait. It is really funny that these things, like, they're literally eating bonita strips. They're eating themselves. Whatever. All right, we got one on. We got them on. Amanda was quick. Fish on, fish on, and she ran over there in like two seconds before I could even look. You're like, fish on, but you're telling Oh, sorry. <laughs> when I just yelled fish on, she thought I was talking about the other rod getting a fish on, but I was talking about her rod. We don't have a double. I can't get like any cranks. You can't get any cranks? Oh man. It could be a nice one. It's gonna say a little prayer. Dear Jesus. Please be Mr. Walker. <laughs> Amen. Make sure your drag's not too high up. Oh, you're good. Okay. Here we go. Sorry. Come on. Do you need help with a planer? Nice fish, guys. I'm like so excited. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. <laughs> I want to. I want to. I wonder what it is. <laughs> Biggest one so far, for sure. Like I can hardly. You need to put in two speed. No. <laughs> no. Uh -huh. Watch the watch the drag. Zebra stripes. Truly, truly a beautiful fish, guys. Well, they are so fast. They're super cool. They're amazing. Let me show you the rig. All right. Let's show you guys our Wahoo rig. We have this purple and white sea witch. All right. Followed by a pink boon squid. And inside the pink boon squid, a shiny, shiny mylar underneath. Followed by... This is our bonita strip, which sits nicely on the hook. Put it through the pin, bottom of the strip, lines up nicely right here with the bottom of the hook. I'll show you a rig one right here. So that's how the bonita strip's supposed to look before it gets eaten. <laughs> then once it gets eaten, it gets destroyed. Following, we have around 15 feet of 60 pound fluoro, followed by another 100 feet of 60 pound mono wind on and then we have our planer and then followed by braid. Thanks for watching guys. You saw us catch an awesome wahoo. 
We targeted it, we worked hard, went through a couple bonitas to get there, but we did it. We did it. Thanks for following along, guys. Everything that's going on with the virus has kept us fishing a bunch. So if you're liking our stuff, make sure you subscribe. We're gonna be uploading extra often right now. Yeah, so please, guys, Gale Force make sure you twins. subscribe. Gale Force Twins on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. YouTube. Thanks for watching.